Mali. Malian junta pardons 49 Ivorian soldiers. The Malian junta pardoned the remaining 46 Ivorian soldiers who were sentenced on December 30, 2022 to 20 years in prison and the three female soldiers already released in September and did not return for the trial to death in absentia. The 49 soldiers were convicted of attack and conspiracy against the Malian government and seeking to undermine state security. The Malian transitional government determined that the Ivorian soldiers were mercenaries operating on its soil because they were carrying passports that did not identify them as soldiers, nor did they possess military orders when they arrived at Bamako International Airport on July 10. According to AP News, the 49 Ivorian soldiers were allegedly working for Sahelian Aviation Services, a private company working in Mali for the United Nations. According to AFP, quote, after the troops were detained, the UN acknowledged some procedural dysfunctions in a note addressed to the Malian government, saying that certain measures have not been followed. The Ivorian presidency also admitted shortcomings and misunderstandings." Unquote. According to Fratmat, on Saturday night, the 46 pardoned Ivorian soldiers remaining in Mali will fly to Lome, the capital of Togo, where they will meet Togolese President Faure Nasingbe, who will hand them over to the Ivorian Secretary of Defense, Tene Birahima Watara, who will return with them to Abidjan, the capital of the Ivory Coast, where they will be received by the Ivorian President Alassane Watara. According to Reuters, Nasingbe met Goita in Bamako on Thursday to mediate on behalf of the Ivorian soldiers.